Hello LEGO fans, adult fan of LEGO UK here and welcome to my review of the LEGO City Coast Guard Helicopter. This is set 60013 for ages 5 to 12. It comes for a, with a piece count of 230 pieces. It currently retails in the UK for £24.99. That's at the LEGO store or the LEGO store online. Okay, so this review is actually a request from one of my subscribers, uh, Lebricks. Um, hopefully I'll put a link down to their channel down in the description. So please go ahead and take a look at um, Lebricks' um, channel and go ahead and subscribe to them too. Okay, so let's get on with the review. First of all, let's take a look at the instruction manual. So we can see here. There's the rear. Our inventory over two pages. Lego City undercover. Um, I've got Lego City there. This is um, advertising the fire sets. You see down there at the bottom. Again, another Lego City shop there, and this is the kind of the Coast Guard theme, which is being shown at the bottom of that one. Um, we've got a total of 70, 78 um, pages of build um, within the instruction manual. Um, sticker sheet, obviously all the stickers have now been applied, but that's a sticker sheet that um, came with the set. Okay, onto the box, quick tour of the box itself. Okay, there is obviously the front of the set, you can see there. 600013. Some of the, um, as always on the rear of the box, we have some of the features obviously shown. Okay. Okay, that's the box. So we can see in front of us now the set all built. Um, first thing I'm going to do is have a quick review of the minifigures. Okay, first up we have our pilot. Let's take a quick look at the pilot. You see the front torso printing. And again, the rear torso printing. Comes with this white helmet and tinted visor. Just take the helmet off. See the face print in there, it's only single sided. Comes obviously with the grey um, hand pieces. See, wearing gloves. Okay, so that is that's our pilot. Okay, next up we have the diver minifigure. Uh, if we start at the bottom, you can see this minifigure, the diver is wearing these flippers. So if I just remove one of those there, I can see an actual flipper there, and it just simply attaches to the feet. Um, front torso printing. Um, the printing is exactly the same, I believe, is what's on the um, pilot. And on the rear underneath this, so this here, is the breathing apparatus. Um, got the same white helmet, but this one's got the um, goggles and snorkel, which we can see there. So we'll just remove that. Different face printing on this one, but again, it's only single sided. I'm not going to take the breathing apparatus off because the rear um, is the same as the pilot, which I just showed you. So that's our diver mini. Next up, we have the Rescuer, and as you can see this is a female minifigure, um, blue legs, grey torso, so first of all you can see the rear torso print in there, um, she's wearing this life jacket, as you can see there, it's yellow, um, holding a radio so she can communicate with the pilot and the um, diver, she's got this blue um, cap on, it's like a baseball cap. Um, obviously you can see on top headphones again so obviously she can communicate so let's just remove that 
so face print in there, single sided again. Just going to take the head off so that we can remove the knife jacket and so on this radio. So we can now see the torso printing. You can see there. Okay, so that is our rescuer. Okay, final minifigure is our sailor. You can see in front of us now. Again, wearing the same yellow life jacket. Okay, let me see. Different face again on this one. There's brown hair. Single sided. Let's just remove the life jacket. You can see the front torso printing and rear torso printing. So this one's actually wearing a wet suit, our sailor. You can see the zip at the back there. You can kind of see the detail on the torso um, there. So this is obviously going to be the person or the individual that is being rescued via the helicopter. Okay, so our final figure is this great white shark. You can see here in front. Okay, it's all one moulded main part apart from this, which does come off like so. So that just attaches there. And that is obviously the mouth. You can see in there the teeth um, for the great white shark. So that is our great white shark. Onto the set itself, we'll start off with the catamaran sailboat. Have a quick look at that. Quite a basic build. Um, got the rudder on the back here, which obviously can move around. The actual sail piece is made from this type of plastic material. You can see there, so the function on this one is you can have a failing sail. So the front here, we have this clip here so we can unclip like so, and then the sail will just drop down. Um, so that's where it is depicting the broken sail. So that's our sailboat or catamaran. Okay, so next up we have our helicopter itself, as you can see, just landing. So let's take this and bring it closer to the camera, show you some of the features. So first of all, obviously, the um, helicopter rotor blades itself. The main one will obviously spin. Um, and again, at the rear here. Okay, so we have space in the centre there for our rescuer, that's where our rescuer would be positioned and obviously our diver before they're lowered down to um, make any rescues. Okay, the pilot obviously sits inside the copper here so this whole piece just simply lifts off like so. There's the actual cockpit piece. Okay, so we can see inside the cockpit. The cockpit. And you can see down there, there's this printed piece there. Uh, if we can just get a bit of shot of that there, yeah. That's an actual printed piece. We have some controllers here, and then our minifigure will just simply um, sit there to obviously fly the helicopter. So I guess the main feature on this is actually this winch, and it's a pretty cool little feature actually. So if we can put it at that angle, we can see here, here's the winch, and we can just simply pull this out like so. And that our diver would obviously hang on to that and be lowered down to the water. This piece here can be adjusted as well. Um, but the good piece uh, function on this is this little orange button here. If we press that, we will see the winch um, comes back in. So I think that's all the features on here. Obviously, underneath we have uh, wheels. So these are fixed in position. We'll spin, obviously, this one here. The front wheel rotates so that the helicopter can actually um, be steered 
um, when it's actually landed. So I'll just show you that now. So obviously when it's down on the ground, not only can it go like that, but it can all it can spin right round and obviously uh, be steered to position um, once it's landed. Okay, so that's the main features of the helicopter itself. So just going to put some of these minifigures actually in situ and I'll be back. Okay, so now with the minifigures actually in place, uh, so again we can see the helicopter in front. You can see the diver there attached to the winch. So I'll just pull that out like so. You can see our rescuer in the centre. She's obviously looking down, making sure um, the diver's okay. And actually, inside the helicopter itself, you should just be able to make out in there the pilot. It's obviously in there now, flying the helicopter. Okay, so obviously what's going to happen now is the helicopter comes across to make the rescue. So we can see down here our catamaran sailboat is having some difficulties and the diver's being lowered down before the great white shark obviously attacks and uh, eats our sailor up. Um, as we can see there. Okay guys, that's it for the main features and for this review of this set. Um, hope you enjoyed this review. As always, please go ahead and give this a thumbs up. Um, provide me with any comments down in the comment section and please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. For our sign off I will just quickly share with you the spare pieces. Ok guys there's all the spare pieces that came with the set. <clears throat> you can see um, some accessories for the minifigures. The visor, the snorkel and the mask and another set of headphones there, spare tyre. Um, some 1x1 one one plates, cheese slope and some Technic pieces and a couple of studs there and obviously that lever. Ok guys, there we go. Um, thanks very much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Cheers!